How can life get any better than this here, boy? I'm here to stop by my friend here, the man, one and only Avi. I'm sure he's my board day to the 20 board day. Look over here, boy. This man grilling some good things here, boy. Happy birthday, buddy. Thank you. So you invite me one time for next year? One time for next year. Make Thank sure you. Come. Thank you, brother. Yeah, I will be here. Don't forget, you know. Come, you come, your calendar. come before me wake up. No take worries. <laughs> good, man. Good. Thanks, thanks for inviting me and um, happy birthday, man. Enjoy. All right? We got some goodness here. We got more things here. We got some corn to grill. The man got some luck, you know, over here. Look at the way, man. I see the peacock. Tail It's luck, you know, This man is a Hey! I look for friend here. Life can never get better, boy. We know you just be watching the show. <laughs> Gilbaka or Lokanani, right? Good morning. Another brand new day here in oh beautiful Guyana. Sunshine. Life can never get better. Hope you guys are doing okay. You're being fun. You're doing positive things. You know, fun things. Hey, I'm about to begin yet another adventure. My girl, living my best life, cook up some nice gilbaka curry. I gotta stop by. I gotta check the fellas by the construction site. I have to head up to Captain White by. The man is back from Northwest. You know, he brought some real good stuff for me. Gilbaka and other things, you know. So I have to make a few errands. Hey, hope you guys are doing all right. Join me on yet another adventure. Please be reminded, pro at the seal. We have new arrivals, you know, vehicles. You can see the number here for a pro. That's a my fish pro in case you need to buy a car. And I want to say a special thank you to um, Auntie Nisha, all the way from Canada. Thanks to this lovely gift, including the chocolate. We already eat all the chocolates. <laughs> Join me and let me head up the East Coast to begin yet another adventure. Look around to a fan here, man. What's your name, man? Ravi. Ravi, and you say from New York? Yeah. Who you want to dig up, man? Dig up all the guys here from New York who just look at the ARD, ARD show. show. No yeah. problem, no Especially problem. Alligator. Alligator? Yeah, right. from North Carolina. No he problem. Always, uh, stock, but he always watch it too. Oh, nice. I'm not telling you he's been attacked. Stock, no then, problem. Yeah, you say what you ask for the video success. Yeah. Success, no mean a chance to go there yet. Yeah. <laughs> Pleasure meeting you, man. Right? Thank you. Appreciate more. Yeah. yeah well, I love that. Cool. Success. Success, Village. I'm going to do it, boy. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm going to tell you, man. You all right? Yeah, man. You just watch my show, man. Yeah, yeah. I'm just watching your show, too. Appreciate, man. Appreciate yeah. Thank you, man. Satish, me and your um, wife, Andrew, from Enmore. Enmore. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, no, Andrew, my family, my cousin, lah. Yes, my family. Pleased to meet you, all right? Good everybody. <laughs> so, hey, I look Metro. My girl, Gaitri Singh. Look, we old building, we old company where we used to work, y'all. My girl, Gaitri Singh, and Natasha Tularam, and Andrew Dwarka, Dave Singh, Navin Singh, Anand Ramnarain, and James Arjun, Pars Ram. You know, this was a crew down there. But I saw Neela Duki, or Neelam. I can't remember all the people that work with us together here across the metro office and computer supplies back in the 90s, you know. I worked there. Ab Abdul Shamir Rashid, Mr. Singh, shot man, this guy, Trio Fado from Lusitnan. You know, all these were part of the metro team. The first set of folks. They had Shoreman, and um, I can't remember everybody, but um, big up to all you guys if you ever watch the show, man. Metro. The building's still standing, but you know the company moved to uh, that was the warehouse now, and the company moved to Georgetown, um, Kroll Street, and they have um, they used to have UG and Kwamina Street, different branch they have. All right, so I'm here at the construction site, and let me show you guys what it's looking like right now. Uh, the car lot looking up good, man. Really big and nice. Everybody's walking on the fence there. Uh -huh. All right, all right. Can never get better than this here. Pro Auto Seal, we coming up here shortly, you know. Good. I made a stop here, Mon Repose Market, you know. Come in there. I see plant in selling 
three pounds for 500, which is not bad, that's cheap. Look at the market, there, buddy. All the freshness and goodness there. Yeah, buddy, what's up? <laughs> hey, hey, what's going on, buddy? Yeah, you're not planting sheep right now, three pounds for 500. I just see the sign suck when I'm by. I'm fried fish, you remember what Good. Yeah, yeah. That's my partner there, man. I'm by his house sitting out here. What's going on? What's going on? Life can't get better, why? Good to see you. How are you doing, Papa? Yeah, what's up? What's going on? No, she's planting, selling oh, 500 pounds yeah, yeah. here. Yeah. So that's my partner, I'm by there. Good. Five hours is a street pong, I see. Uh huh. Okay, now, friend. Yeah. Man. yeah. I get a piece of this plant in there, friend. Who else is now? You are the man. No, I know. Good. Good. Plant in there, boys. What's some green one there? And a thousand dollars, the man. That could be uh, six pong. Yeah. All right, good. I tell you all, I'm making a stop by Captain White Bay. Welcome home. This man was in that. So how many months was he? Three weeks. Oh, the time before was two months, right? Yeah. And now it's three weeks. All right. So the man brought back some nice um, yellow baka and uh, snapper, fish eggs, and among other things. All right. I got to go see the man, you know. All right. Now look what we're doing. We're doing big thing that we're making some food there, you know. Watch. The chef cooking up there. So by now, Friday we gonna lash. Life can never get better than this here, boy. <laughs> Good to see you once again, boy. And you're gone back in a couple of days. Yeah. Back to Northwest. All right, all right. I, mean, I, mean, up today. I see you caught a lot of gilbackers on the uh, videos oh, that you, you, you made, yeah. That one I sent a set for you, there. And you sent for me, yeah, definitely. So? And fish get some too. Go to gilback here. <laughs> and my fish bro, you cook out my gill back ahead, buddy. That's supposed to be the board, the kangan. <laughs> and you can cook out my gill back ahead. Anyway, you got to replace it, right? <laughs> Captain White, I'm going to send the next one. Oh, yeah, buddy. <laughs> All right. But you're going to trade five lokanani for the gill back ahead. Uh, All right? Couldn't get better than this, eh? We're going to chit chat. Man, sipping on something good there. Hey, we continue the adventure. This man and me date back on a year, right? But long story by long story. Since about um, 2005 or so. Uh, about 20 years? Yeah, about 20 years, my friend. 20 years. This is my story. This is my friend, Mulan. Mulan, Mulan and me, Mulan, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I know I know you through him. Yeah, yeah. And you'll be watching this program now. Yeah, I'll watch your program. I'll watch him. Your daughter, your yeah. wife, and everybody. You remember Sally, yeah. man? Hello. <laughs> How you doing? Alright. Pleased to meet you. Welcome to the show. I'm ready. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Okay. <laughs> Sally! Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Wow. This man here, Grand Chair, so I I the back in the race, mate. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> good to see you, all right? All right, man. Say hello to everybody. Are you good? Yeah, yeah. You're not shot to your husband, yeah? You got shy, right? <laughs> Big up to your husband, right? <laughs> all right, life can't get better than this. All right, right? Daniel, okay, so what? Appreciate it, man. Thank you. Right? Right? No problem, man. All right. Pleasure to meet you, all right? Okay. Made a stop here by the sings. I smell some curry. <laughs> I hear you, I'll cook some curry and I smell it. What's going on? What's up? How can life get better? We live in the best life right, while we're creating right. um, beautiful, beautiful memories. memories. Y'all know what I'm coming? You, you take out Porgola? <laughs> nice, um, nice, nice. We're doing some adjustments right now. Yeah, I can see you're doing some uh, work <laughs> in the house, but that's nice. Yes. All right, thanks. I hear you cook some nice know. curry, man. Oh, let's see. Ooh, uh. How life can get any better than that? Can get oh, my gosh. Life can never get better. I made a stop here, I gotta lash some of the Gilbaka curry. Smell good there, Nari? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right now, yeah. Good to see you, man. Yeah. You know, son, Nari confused because Javid mom sent him dollar rice, uh -huh. Karela okra, and stew saltfish. And the man had to choose between Gilbaka and, and that. that. I, I can choose the and the rice and the selfish and the okra. Really? Yeah, buddy. Right. I can leave the gill back out to take away. I'll still take home that. <laughs> I'm gonna lash some goodness there right now. When you're eating, you're eating. See this nice yellow pepper there? Flavor pepper. The tomatoes. And look at them fish there, buddy. <laughs> I could 
My mouth running water, I'll salivate it right now. Cheers. What does this thing taste though? Like hasa. You throw hasa masala in here or what? No. It tastes like hasa though. It's like the moringa. Curry. It's the moringa. Oh, cheers. Yeah. I feel like eating hasa curry here. You're making the best hasa curry. So far I eat and if I tell you it tastes like hasa curry, it tastes proper. All right, buddy. Thank you. I can get some to take home. Yeah, we have, sure. lot. We have a lot. Mm. I know. So my y'all don't just Chewing your teeth or suck your teeth. <laughs> For those who don't understand the Guyanese dialect, chew your teeth or suck your teeth, go like this. Right? When I eat in. But sorry. I know you are drooling, but I'm sorry. Cheers. This is what I meant when I say how can life get any better than this? Life can. We're creating beautiful memories while we live in the best life. Cheers. Yeah, I can guess how it tastes. Look at the plate. It's shine. Cheers. Made a stop here in Montrose. I gotta check out the workers, you know, I gotta pay the workers. And you see where I park? Because I don't want to come through there and drive up the one way. A lot of drivers does that, okay? So I'm gonna park there and I'm gonna walk rather than driving all the way around the rice doesn't come back. Okay? They need to remove this median here, man. Remove this entire strip here so folks can come here and stop and turn in. Or who come out and come out here, stop and turn this way. Alright? They need to remove it. You understand? People gotta do all kind of miracle to, to cross here. So all they have to do is extend this turning lane all the way here so that folks can turn in or turn out. Simple bro. I hope the relevant people do it as early as possible man you know let us not wait until something bad happened down here see the fella torn in there he could have come till here and torn but you know i guess he waiting to go across to turn up the one way i'm not gonna put him on camera but at least we're gonna tell you how he does that oh no he tore you see he, he tore and he went back now with that car it's gonna turn there and it's gonna reverse all the way and come back here. See? It's not reversing coming back. I'm not gonna show you more details because you know. People do these things man. People turn, reverse up the one way and then turn through the street. So when is it that the relevant authority is gonna do the right thing? You know, to remove this uh, medium from the middle here. You notice the car just torn in there, right? He just, the fellow torn, he reversed, and then he drive through there. That is what a lot of folks do. So I am appealing on the relevant authority, please remove that median so folks can torn. You need a hot dog to check this one out. Here. Remove that median that people can torn. And also fix this thing here, man. Widen this torn here. When, when the big trucks come to bring sand for me, it's really difficult to turn here. Oh. What are you doing, buddy? Oh. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. What part of them, man? So, it's just my two cents, and I hope that the folks can, the folks in um, authority, you know, the relevant people, the honorable people of Guyana, can fix that, alright? Anyway. I gotta go into the construction site now. It's a park and walk because I want to reverse up the one way. Fence looking good there man. By Crawford did a good job. Looking real nice. Now the parking lot looking up good you know. 
Sure, fuck it that way. Wow, okay, hard way. Good, good. A lot of parking, you know. Pro Auto Seal and the ARD Auto Seal coming here, you know, very soon. Alright? So that's what I'm is doing right now. This is what the yard looking up like. Another month from now, we can got Auto Seal up here. Hey, we got a boat. We're selling the boat, you know. I'm selling that boat, right? It's a 16 feet length by 4 feet at the bottom on the floor width. The depth is 21 inches. Strong boat, very thick material. And I have a 40, a brand new 40 Yamaha engine. Long foot, never go in the water, never use. They're selling the whole package, 2 million Ghana dollars or 10,000 US, all right? And you come with the trailer, so the trailer is for free. So in case you need it, just let me know, drop it in the um, comment, or you can WhatsApp message me on 917-293-3300. If you're interested in the boat or vehicles, all right? So the goodness um continue here boys. How can life get any better than this here boy? I'm gonna stop by my friend here, the man one and only Avi. I try the man board day to the 20 board day. Alright, and I see some fans here too. And he from Canada be watching my show. I don't call him here. Number is doing big things, you know what? Look at that. And look how from Canada there. Man be watching the show, you know. Look over here, buy this man grilling some good things here, buddy. Happy birthday, buddy. Thank you. So you invite me one time for next year? One time for next year. Make Thank sure you. you Thank you, brother. I will be here. Don't forget, you know. Come, we'll come, we'll we'll come before me wake up. No take worries. <laughs> good, man. Good. Thanks, thanks for inviting me. And um, happy birthday, man. Enjoy. All right? We got some goodness here. We got more things here. We got some corn to grill. The man got some luck, you know, over here. Look at what going on. see the peacock. Teal there. It's luck, you know. This man is a chick. Hey! I look for friend here. Life can never get better, boy. We know you just be watching the show. <laughs> Gilbaka or Lokanani, right? Good to see you, man. I really appreciate you following the show, man, right? You want to tell them about anything over there? You want to say hello? Tell them so I'll stay here with ARD. One ARD. And one and only. One and only ARD. Yeah, man. We gotta come man, to life and direct. I gotta come Canada soon. Thank you. Bye, Bye, August. August. Ah, August. 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 Villagers, you know, we all we are all from Hampton Court Esukibo. Everybody here is Hampton Court Esukibo or Sparta Esukibo. We are all neighbors, friends, you know, grew up relatives, you know, having a good time here, man. You know, celebrating Avi's birthday. And that's how you come together and have fun, man, and celebrate. Now look, I have a super super fun here. How are you doing? Answer you okay? Me. Give me a, a bong here. What is your name? All right, so who you want to say hello to? You want to say hi to mommy or anybody else? Just go ahead, say it. Say hello, mommy. No, you have to look at the <laughs> Look at the camera and say hi, mommy. Hello, mommy. All right, who else you want to say hello to? Tina. Say hi, Tina. Hi, Tina. Wow, and you like watching the ARD show? Every night you watching, you and daddy watching every night? Every day. Wow, wow, it's a pleasure meeting you, man. Same thing here. Yeah, you look familiar, man. If I ask you, by chance? Um, I have some family there from Charity. Charity? You didn't yes. went to an original multi by chance? No, I used to work on everything. You look know him, man. I'm a Eskimo man, too. Okay, okay. <laughs> we can talk about it after the recording. Sure, it's a pleasure sure. meeting you, man, right? Yeah. Pleasure meeting you, my little friend. And thank you for watching the show, right? Now you're going to be seeing yourself on the show. On the show, right? Good. So now you have evidence you meet ARD, right? See you and I on the camera now? Good? Pleased to meet you. Life can get better than this, right? Lovely. Good afternoon. Another beautiful day. 
Look at that setting sun there, boy. And in the skies, you can see kites. Easter just around the corner, two weeks from now. East Coast Highway, the Rupert Craig Highway. And down here by the gas station, Bel Air. And the back there is Bel Air Village. Across there. Sapphire is at the back there. You see the signs of Bel Air? But look at that setting sun. They had to show you guys the sun, man. This road is busy, bad, you know. A lot of trucks, man. Construction booming in Guyana. Alright. Not a beautiful day. We're continuing the adventure. One stop shop in a little mini mart in there. I wonder if this place got restroom. Because you know the, the um, places in America, you know, the rest stop. You could shower, you got bathroom, food, you know, a lot of things. So I hope we up the bar here in Guyana. Anyway, we're continuing the adventure. Look at the lingering sunset there, boy. I'm heading down to Georgetown. I want to turn through Conversation Road or Conversation Street. We got in this Conversation Road. But I want to show you guys how it developed. There's going to be a major, um, a major road here now, four lane, which is going to take you all the way, connecting you to the Heroes Highway. Look at this. Who? Will, can recognize Bel Air Conversation Road. See that? Look how broad it gets. But it needs a stoplight here. There's no stoplight. This is not good at all. Alright. This is not the best. It's confusion. Look at all the development here in Bel Air, boy. They have the big G's, used to be on my right hand here. And then in here, you go into Bel Air, the Mandir and the school and thing at the back there. So straight up ahead, they're gonna make the road. I see they're, they're doing the diversion there already. Look at that. is another place if you want to stay Bransville Hotel you can look them up on Google all right back in the days this place used to be Mutt's Cafe man upstairs sports bar and grill Stone Avenue you're gonna buy Bodan this is Pike Street I'm driving on I buy Bodan across there man all your bangs beer and other things you know Look at the beauty of the sunset there, way. Imagine I, if I was on cloud nine, you know, sipping on something and uh, enjoying the beautiful sunset or the setting sun. Now, this is Sheriff Street, busy as can be. I 
would have expected the Sheriff Street to be a four lane road, but there's only two lane. It was a little bit disappointing, you know. Should have been a four lane. It's broad, can accommodate four lanes, but we only have two. But they're making other lanes that's gonna accommodate the um, traffic, you know. So yeah, I get in a little evening drive around. Around Georgetown. To the seawall to show you how it looks like by the bandstand here. Selena roundabout or Kitty public road. I want to say Ramadan Mubarak or Ramadan Kareem to every one of you guys watching this video, especially the Muslim community. My Muslim brothers and sisters, look at that lingering sunset that way. Still, still lingering around there. Eh? Beautiful man. I give you a little drive show of we boardwalk, Guyami, we Guyami Beach. You see how the uh, mangrove tree growing up on the seawall there. Sooner than later, you won't be seeing no beach. Well, behind the Marriott, you will have beach area. But I want to believe they're privatizing that. I'm not sure. I heard something that they're building a park at the back there. I'm not sure. If it's true, well then, it's not going to be free for all no more to go in and fish and things like what we used to do. I guess they're going to be fees, you know, entrance fees. But nonetheless, um, to maintain the place to keep it nice and clean yeah if you have to have you know fees because in america you always pay fees when you go to the beach to go fishing and stuff right so yeah i remember when we go to um in florida there you gotta pay when you go on the piers all right when you go by sky bridge there you have to pay but look at how peaceful and beautiful um the sunset look there by Man, couldn't ask you anything better. Imagine you out here drinking, drinking some cold juice and you know, anything cold, watching the Atlantic Ocean, enjoying the cool atmosphere. Have no fear, life can never get better. Trust me. The mangrove tree not growing at this part, so yeah, we have a few more years before it grow up and you know take over all the view. But you have some really nice, cool places out here, man, that you can come and hang out and uh, you know with your family, celebrate, enjoy. You don't have to drink beers or alcohol, you know. You just come out here, sip on some orange juice, get some food, enjoy the atmosphere, all right? So don't think you have to come out here, you have to drink man's beer or any other beer or, or, or anything. Bring your family out, sit down on the seawall, breathe some fresh air off the Atlantic Ocean, eat some nice food, and you know, you head home. You could even bring your own food if you wish and your own water and juice, your cooler, whatever in your cooler stays in your cooler. And you enjoy an evening out with your family. We having roadblock there, maybe no entry, so I have to go around from the other side. Alright. Or maybe I gotta park and walk. Don't know as yet. Pegasus Hotel. 
taking y'all down for a ride on the bandstand. Hopefully, the road didn't block off from the western entrance. I don't know. I hope not. If there's any event on the beach, then yes, they're gonna block off the uh, roadways to vehicular traffic. Looks like everybody turning around here. So, which means there might be a um, roadblock over here. Too. I was advised that the president of Guyana having an event on the beach there on the Kingston uh, Bandstand area. So civilians are not allowed or those who are not invited. So of course I wasn't invited so I can't go. So I cannot get to show you guys what it looks like at the back there. Alright? So maybe another night. But they're having something at the back there, some special event, maybe partying into Ramadan. So um, yeah, understood. So um, I'm gonna have to turn back from here. <laughs> Both sides are closed off, so you cannot enter from none side unless you're invited, all right? But in the meantime, this is what it looks like here on the beach. So no uninvited dinings or visitors cannot I guess I have to go home and relax and tomorrow is going to be another brand new day. Good morning. Another beautiful morning here in Georgetown, Guyana. I'm on East Street. Busy area, you know. Next to the Georgetown Public Hospital. Now, this area is known for the medical area all the medical um places around here the balancing hospital across there all the pharmacies the pharmacy barneys you have ultrasound across there you have the optical on the other side and they have this food cart here that catch my eyes the sun the smell at this place and these folks are big fans of mine look across here you have another medical center there you have the uh, eye clinic and then uh, other medical center there, the public hospital, you have the, um, the nurse in school somewhere around here. It's how far the nurse in school eh? Right behind you here. That's why I said no the nurse in school. This is Green Building eh? Right behind there is the nurse in school. And these folks are fans. Alright, we have here. This was Sanita's. Sanita's Meals on Wheels. And this food tastes so nice, it sell out. The breakfast finish. Yes. Wow. And now you're making lunch. Are you preparing it right here? So it's cooked fresh, daily. Hot meals, right? They have all a nice curry here. Chicken curry and lots of more different curry. <laughs> right, fried rice and thing. What are you cooking today? Black eye cook up chicken. Black eye cook up chicken today. That's on the menu. No problem. Y'all want to say hello to everybody? Can I know y'all are fans? Watching ARDs. Hi. No problem. <laughs> George, my hiding. <laughs> it's a pleasure meeting you, all right? Thank you. you. Take it easy. I'll come back for lunch. I bring my vehicle to wash across there. So if lunch finished by time I pick up my vehicle, I'll pick up lunch. All right. You take it easy, all right? Yeah. yeah. Hey, take care of everybody, right? Oh, shoot. Oh, look. This man gave me juice for the house, man. I'm to hide from the camera, though. <laughs> all right. Life's going to get better than this, man. I got I got what juice is this? Guava, you all make it yourself? Yes. Lovely, I'm going to taste it and give you a review, yeah. don't worry. I uh, appreciate my all the best, right? Thank you. Appreciate my, thanks. So walking through the avenue here. So I was telling you guys, a lot of medical uh, facilities are on this street. You have the, you have this one. Is that access? I know, Miranda Bright. 
I wear optical, Guyana, orthopedic clinic. In science, you got some fancy word, you know. So we don't really know to call out of them. We have optic vision care over here. You got fish pharmacy at the end there. So you know, you have a, a lot of medical um, places and institutions on this street here. All right, another beautiful day where uh, I, I see it get a little bit cloudy here right now. It was a bright and sunny day, but we get a little clouds here right now. All right, so give me a little walk through of this East Street area. You know, even just driving through alone now, we walk in through now. All right, so all the way down here, there's one entrance to the guy in the George and Public Hospital. That's one of the entrance. That's the southern entrance. And you have the eastern entrance over here on East Street itself. All right, and this is New Market Street. This entrance here. The other corner of that said is Lamaha Street. But I'm heading east because I'm walking home. Alright. Cheers. Mm hmm Taste the guava there, boy. I haven't had a guava in a long time, so at least now I'm drinking the guava here. A guava juice. Cheers. It tastes good. Not too much sugar. It's light sugar. And you can taste the, the actual guava. It's not overwhelming with sugar or, or essence or other things. You're tasting the guava in it. Cheers. Aye. Good for the sun, you know. The sun came back right out. Alright? Hey. Life is good. Taking a little walk out. Walk around town. Exercise a little early morning exercise. Life could never get better than this. What you just told me? How, uh, how can life get better than this? Life could never get better than this. Look around, it was super super funny man. Yeah, they all even share that. Yeah, I from Trinidad. You want to yeah. grab Trinidad? You want to pick up anybody up in Trinidad? Eh? Yeah, pick up my mom and them. Um, I want to pick up my uncle from Maryland. Eh. Maryland? What's your, they your, your show? They watch your show and they start to make them. Oh, nice. What's the name of the, of the channel, yes. you know? Andy, Maryland, and Tio. Andy, Maryland, and Tio. Yeah. Fellow YouTubers, yeah, please check them out. And they catch him fish and things like me. Yeah. Lovely, it's lovely. Encourage them and them. Nice, man. Don't you want to see this? It'll be mine right there. Okay, never forget that, too. So, we'll come, guys, and you want to come and meet me. Definitely, but you know where I am now. You yeah. know how to find me, man. Yeah. Life could never get better than this, you boy. Okay, love you, I'm a crowd. Yeah. Big fans, big fans. Yeah. Thank you. I hope you have a rodeo. Yeah. I'm encouraging them to go to rodeo. Yeah. All right. It's a pleasure meeting you, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah man. Why? <laughs> I know. Even a long time you're watching the show. Yeah. I wanted to meet me. Yeah. Man, I'm happy. Yeah. I, I finally ran into you, man. Yeah. All right. Last night I came out here at the Esplanade, but His Excellency had an um, event here, so none uninvited folks couldn't come here. So um, yeah, this morning I'm coming back here to show you guys, you know, the upgrade, how it looks. They look really nice, boy. Look at that. Uh huh. You can sit down now, rain or sun. You can come and lime out. This is nice. I really love what I see here. I love the wood too. You know, good quality wood it was built nicely whoever the contractor is take a big up for that it's nice and the brainchild behind um this is take a big up the forest lady and the president and the forest lady team you see i just give big up where big up that i get to know i give credit to who gotta get credit you see they had um they had a stage there they have a stage there so they had something out there last night all right. 
Where credit are needed, the credits are needed, I give it. I like uh, seeing, you know, look, my favorite spot to the top that we just come and hang out, my, me and my fish pro. Yeah. And Miss Lynch and Andrea and Miss Singh. And Shad, man, you know, the ARD team. I have to go to um, Digicel. I'm setting up the ARD auto sale. So I have to get a phone number, SIM cards. So that's why I'm here. Beautiful morning. Beautiful skies, man. The Pegasus Hotel looking up real good. So right in this building up here, there is a Digicel store. One of the network providers in Guyana. I have three providers, Digicel, GTNT, and E Networks. So um, yeah, I'm heading into um, Digicel to get a SIM card. Across there is the GBTI head office, Guyana Bank for Trade and Industry. I think. I hope I'm correct. Look how nice this place look. Alright, so I'm gonna go to the card now and I'll continue the adventure. Not sure what else I'm gonna show you guys. I finished getting my SIM card, you know. Did you sell it right behind me? And that's the lovely um, Pegasus Hotel. Alright? Now look at that. Goodness save I. If you come to Guyana you want a nice place to stay, Pegasus. This here and even across there. That's the old Pegasus and this is the new one. And it's fancy, you know, like the ones in America, on South Beach. We got Miami Beach at the back there. Right? Yeah, I'll have Miami Beach and South Beach. We got Miami. <laughs> anyway, I got my SIM card and the phone number is, um, I think it's 672 5205. In case you want to get on to um, ARD Auto Sale. Yeah, we're setting up a new Auto Sale. We have Pro Auto Sale and we have ARD Auto Sale, right? 672 5205. I'll advertise it, don't worry, on Facebook and stuff, alright? So, if you want cars and bus and all other things, you can check out ARD Auto. Pro Auto Sale also sell trucks, you know, buses, cars, whatever you name it. Yeah, both Auto Sales sell the same things, alright? Hey, I hope you guys enjoy the tour with me. I think I'm gonna end the video here, man, because um, I don't wanna make the video too long. But I just love the, uh, the scenery here at the Pegasus. I hope you guys enjoy the couple of days with me. Hope you're being fun, you're being positive. I wanna thank you all for the privilege of your time. Take care of you and each other, and be sure to check out ARD Auto Sale, all right? I think it's gonna be ARD Auto on Facebook. And don't forget Pro Auto, all your vehicle needs. Take care of each other. God bless you all. Peace out. Well, I'll show you all a little bit from a high altitude. This place looks like Florida, why? Look at that. To all my Floridians, peeps, look, I am Florida. I'm joking, guy, I'm not looking like Florida now. <laughs> all right, I'll see you all on another adventure.